Iron Man, made his debut in Tales of Suspense, issue 39, in March 1963, against the backdrop of the Vietnam War, signaling the end of Marvel's monster and suspense line of comics. Stan Lee, envisioned his new hero, as a rich businessman, continuing in the tradition of the pampered playboy, that dates back to the Scarlet Pimpernel. Tony Stark, like Batman's alter ego Bruce Wayne, would be a gorgeous, successful, and wealthy businessman. Stark, on the other hand, would have a dreadful secret, his heart was also wounded, in the accident that led to him becoming Iron Man. To stay alive, he required his armor chest plate. Stan Lee and Larry Lieber, discussed the overall framework for Iron Man, and Lieber eventually developed a detailed script for the origin narrative. In the story, Tony Stark is visiting Vietnam, to demonstrate one of his weapons to the US military. While on a trip to the front lines, Stark is injured by shrapnel from a landmine, and is captured by the Viet Cong. They give him an ultimatum, build them a weapon, or die. With the help of Ho Yin Sen, a fellow captive and scientist, Stark builds a suit of powered armor, to save his own life, and escape captivity. He uses the suit to fight his way out of the Viet Cong camp, and back to the United States. Upon returning home, Stark decides to use his intellect, wealth, and resources, to fight injustice, and protect the world as the armored superhero known to everyone as Iron Man. The new character of Iron Man was to be created by Don Heck, an illustrator who had worked on several Western and monster stories throughout the years. The cover was done by Jack Kirby, who was the standard cover artist for Tales of Suspense. Iron Man's armor, like the Hulk's, was originally gray, but due to printing issues, it was changed to golden yellow for his second appearance. <laughs>